here. That is Dr. Ben Carson. You got a spring in your heel this morning when you see those fox poles, <laughs> Doctor? <laughs> Well, you know, I, I don't put a lot of stake in the polls because, as you know, historically, presidential polls have, have frequently been off. But it is more encouraging to yeah. see them moving you're happy in, in to this see direction. It. I know you're happy <laughs> to see it. Do you think that, that uh, now, Donald Trump has stuck to the issues, certainly for, for this week, and he's not gone off on a tangent attacking women. He's stuck to the issues, and he's winning on the issues. Do you think he Absolutely. should now pivot a little bit and attack Hillary Clinton? on her scandals? Well, I, I, I don't think he should totally ignore that, but that shouldn't be the, the main focus. You know, right now, he's got this wonderful gift that was given to him, you know, regarding the so-called Affordable Care Act. And, uh, you know, he needs to be emphasizing what this means. You know, basically, it's a rob Peter to pay Paul scheme. We give health care to a group of people and we make it impossible for another group to get it. That doesn't make any sense. You know, it's supposed to be liberty and justice for all. These are, these are issues he should really be pounding on right now, and he's going to. Yesterday, I think it was in North Carolina, he talked about trade schools, vocational education for inner city folks. Um, you approve of that? You think that's a good line of approach? It's an excellent line of approach because, you know, I was talking to a CEO of a company not long ago. He said, boy, I, if, if I could get a welder, just give me an apprentice welder. I will pay him extremely well. You know, you can't find these people anymore. We're not teaching them. And uh, it's one of the areas that, that Donald Trump has talked about. You know, we have all these people going into prisons and they go in with little education and no skills and they come out with little education and no skills. We could give them some education and some skills and help them obtain a job, it would change the trajectory of their lives and cut down on the recidivism rate because we need to develop all of our people. Do you think he can win? I know that's a loaded question for a man who's been backing Donald Trump for at least a year, but is it not, it's not too late, you say? Uh, my prediction is that he is going to win. Uh, and uh, because I don't believe that the American people are. As, as, as simplistic as the news media and the politically elite think they are. They think they can just pull a few strings and manipulate them and have them believe all kinds of things. I just don't think they're quite that simple. Okay, Dr. Ben Carson, we appreciate you being with us this morning. Thank you very much indeed, sir. Uh, always a pleasure. Thank you, sir.